السلام علیکم و رحمۃ اللہ وبرکاتہ ویلکم ٹو دس ویڈیو ان دس ویڈیو وی ول لرن دا مڈل شیپ آف دا لیٹر جیم ہا خا فیلی سمپل ون آف دا موسٹ کامنلی یوزڈ مڈل شیپس آف دا لیٹر جیم ہا خا از دا فرسٹ شیپ دیٹ وی لرن ان دا انیشیل پوزیشن سو لیٹس ڈو دیٹ لیٹس سی آئی وانٹ ٹو کنیکٹ با ود جیم ہا خا سو وٹ آئی ول ڈو از آئی ول میک دس stroke of ba that we learned and jim ha kha is one of the letters that connects from top we make the next stroke which is this and then you come back and make this stroke this stroke will be approximately two nukta in width and overall jim ha kha will be five nukat as we discussed this remains the same there is no change come up in this direction it's as simple as that so if you observe this part is identical to standalone you can obviously change the shape of bar and make the connection use this hook shape bar come down this fashion and then make your jim ha kha You can apply the nukta here for jim. You can apply the nukta here for kha. Okay? Fairly simple. Another creative way of connecting uh, is simply making the standalone shape. And this rule applies to all three shapes of jim ha kha that we learned. Come down. Go up. and you simply connect from here whichever letter you would be connecting let's say i will connect with lam so you come down and connect the idea was to show that you can connect from here okay so this is about the middle shape of the letter jim ha kha fairly easy the next shape uh, again you write the standalone letter in the same manner this continues going in this direction let's say i want to connect with ba and i want to use this creatively just to make this and this becomes your ha in the middle form extend this and this becomes your alif okay finally you can use the same logic and connect this shape in this manner like this and again connect it in this direction all right so these are the middle shapes of the letter jim ha kha um there is not much that you need to do here um, you just need to practice it with different letters if seen connects with jim ha kha if saad connects with jim ha kha ain if it connects with jim ha kha in the same manner okay um, let me give you a creative uh, or an example of how ain will connect with jim ha kha remember one concept and that is jim ha kha generally connects from top and depending on that you will write the first letter the letter that comes before jim ha kha so this is the initial shape of fine you come down and you simply make your jim ha kha from here that's it all these concepts will make a little more sense once we write more letters for seen and saw you will see a bump which is again a very common phenomena you will learn this when i write seen you go up then make a bump then come down and then make the stroke this one make the jim ha kha this shouldn't be as bumpy so let's write it again 
from here it's just this and then come down this is much better and right here jim ha ha so essentially the third tooth of scene will take a bump remember that same goes with sod when you connect jim ha ha with sod from here you come down go up from here you make that bump and connect your jim ha ha simple okay uh, if you want to connect let's say ta then obviously this stroke will change as we know in ta that stroke changes from here you come down and just make the stroke like this just bend it slightly towards the downwards direction and then again we connect our jim ha ha all right amazing i hope this was easy uh the end form is fairly similar to the standalone shape so we'll cover that here let's um connect this with this shape of ba come down make the shape the end shape will have a slight variation that is in this stroke if you observe this does not tilt as much as this stroke does because standalone shape is flatter then from there you just make your standalone shape which is identical to that shape basically and then you make the stroke fill this in i'm making it roughly so bear with me okay um this is jim and this is your ha all right uh there is one more shape uh in the end form which is again standalone shape uh, it's quite difficult so i suggest you don't focus much on this you just make this stroke the shape rather this one come down and then you pull up from here the same shape that we learned in the standalone it's identical there's no change in this and from here you make the connection to denote this as the end form and not the standalone letter all right although i strongly recommend you to not worry much about this shape because this is a very difficult shape to write and at this level even if you write this shape it should be fine i've written this that's why quite roughly uh, this should cover you pretty much well okay so that's all i have for the end shape of the letter jim ha ha again i keep reminding you because remind does help us we have a fully dedicated app uh, for arabic calligraphy so if you want to learn in depth thuluth advance or any other script like nask diwani ruqa uh, maghribi sumbuli kufi etc you can download our free app and register or enroll in any of those courses i hope you find it valuable i'll see you in the next one assalamu alaikum warahmatullah